What's up guys and welcome back to Just In Time. So if you guys have been following me, I mean I'm not the Parasana, but if you've been following what I've been sharing about, you know that I recently started going for a lot more interviews and that I had gone for quite a few before this. And before that, I, I mentioned that I went for this one particular one that I was really hoping that I would get, but I didn't get. And after that, then I felt really down and I just went into this like spiral for about two or three weeks. I think I shared about this before. And actually what that was, was me not being able to take rejection in like real life. Because that was when, you know, if you're trying to get a girl, uh, for lack of better terms, like you're trying to get a girl then you're going after her and everything and then things don't work out it's like you can still pick yourself back up and you think that I mean for me la, that's what I thought that you know I can handle rejection I can handle people saying no to me but when I was faced with the real deal in real life and I actually feeling that shoot somebody actually turned me down and again when I mentioned I really did bet all my chips on that one so like I was really really hoping for that particular job and then when I did not get that, it it took quite a while for me to like pick myself back up. So basically what I'm sharing about right now is the the feeling of rejection that I went through and actually learning to deal with it no matter the circumstance and no matter what that means to you actually. So like for you maybe a rejection is a, a rejection that you cannot really handle is maybe you know if somebody tells you that you didn't do a good job or if somebody's telling you that, oh, your presentation skills aren't that great. For me, it was the interview. So that was one of the big rejections that actually really got me. It, it kind of like broke me down. Really, really broke me down. So what is the rejection that would break you down? And how are you guys dealing with it or getting over it? It's about the five friends that you always surround yourself with. Doesn't need to be five like exactly, but basically like the friends that you mix with. 